Ahead of the Imo State's governorship election in November, major stakeholders in the electoral process in the state, including the Kuka Center, have urged the residents to renew their confidence in the electoral process and embrace efforts that will guarantee a credible and peaceful polls. Details in this report. Several stakeholders in the electoral process in Nemo State have gathered here to brainstorm on ways to guarantee credible and peaceful conduct of the forthcoming governorship elections. The proffer solutions on several ways to manage the election to ensure a successful outcome. The overall objective of this forum is today's event is critical, especially for the state of the Nigeria elections in human states. And for us, patriots, we believe so much that there is no better state, especially for us in the human state, than the state we call our own. And there is no better country than the country we call our own, our country, Nigeria. And that is why we gather here to discuss, to engage, and to deepen our understanding and our voices with regards to citizens' participation in democracy. But the stakeholders also express worry over the way politicians and other VIPs in the state behave during election day. They want the security agencies and staff of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, to maintain neutrality. For instance, political parties don't plan for election. They plan for violence. They budget for it. If you go to their offices, and why do they do that? They don't have anything to sell to the public. That is number one. Number two, NDLEA must clamp down on drug sources because political parties buy drugs for youths who do violence for them. Third, Imo State must carry out a firearms or this. There's a proliferation of firearms within the state. If you look at the Olu zone, you look at Uguta, you look at Obudia, where, where there's been violence. There's so much ammunition going around. Number four, on election day, as already indicated in the electoral habit, not very explicit, no VIP should move around with security. Until we actually, of course, Simo states somehow have been prone to violence, and that's why it's so necessary that the issue of peace starts early enough to be talked about, and that's why we are here. Yeah. But it's beyond sitting down and talking. It is what we do with the process, the impact, the outcome of this process that really transcends to real peace that can be sustained. And for me, we should look at the problem of how to deal with our diverse population. The stakeholders also urge citizens to have faith in the electoral system so as to avert voter apathy. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.